that last year was um it was tough like i had to have my team psychologist on speed dial and you know for like we we definitely had a more than a few emergency sessions uh, at my home when canadian olympic swimmer brent hayden won the bronze medal at the 2012 games in london he was suffering from intense back spasms and was dealing with personal issues that attributed to his depression he said there was one major factor that helped get him on the journey towards mental wellness and he was doing something so many people are afraid to do talk about it i think that was probably the the biggest hurdle to overcome was being able to actually talk about it i just needed somebody who would give me the care and attention like you know that time to just listen even if they didn't understand and, and that went a really a uh, really long way when hayden retired he fell out of love with swimming and no longer enjoyed it he spent years working on his mental health and now says he's having more fun than ever when he's swimming and has come out of retirement and is working towards representing canada at the olympics this year part of his journey towards mental wellness was learning to let go of what you can control between now and then um I'm just going to the pool and uh, doing what my coach tells me to do. Um, and, uh, you know, I'm just going to stick with my program and just, uh, again, focus on the things I can control. Although he's optimistic about the upcoming games, he's taking it one day at a time. There's actually still a chance that the Olympic Games in Tokyo might not happen uh, at all. So, um, but, you know, that's out of my control. Whether I get to go or not, I think this whole journey will have been worth it. Hayden says if the games happen to be canceled, the silver lining is that he will have even more time to prepare for the Paris Olympics, which are now just three years away. Lindsay Dunn, City News.